you know I gotta keep it real, dog, because you my people. I hit you a text message the next day after your fight. But bro, that was a tough one in Richmond. The people want answers. You left the building. This, what do you gotta say to the people? It was a funny performance. Um, I got no records out there, and then the work was all that stuff. Uh, a lot of good play, played out of my benefits, uh, but I'm, I'm, you know, I'm getting trapped again, working on the basic fundamental, and uh, just a different fighter than each other. What did you overlook about your opponent going into that fight? I took it lightly. I was really, really, you know, really serious about the fight. I fought it plenty of times, you know. And I should have, that was my mistake, you know. I should have never taken it lightly. I should have trained, like, you know, just fighting anybody, anybody else that has a competitive person. And I should have never taken it lightly. That was my, that was my downfall. But. So are you back in the gym training and working on things again? Yeah, I'm working on a lot of these days. Right now, I'm still trying to keep it light because I injured my hand on like my second bout in TJ. And it's consistent every other fight I get, get in there one more and more, and then this that fight. So we look forward to seeing you back in the ring soon, and hopefully you can fight maybe Jonathan Zamudio again, maybe in Richmond again. Yeah, we don't want to see you again, but we won't be the same fight.